Quick questions on your teammates. Nick Cummins, uh, public speaking, career ahead of him in that? Oh, I think so. He'd be pretty good at some of those lunches that uh, a few rugby circles have. Um, I don't know, it depends how, if his uh, book of sayings runs out, it depends how that goes. <laughs> where, where, where is that coming from? Is he, is he Googling before each game to come nah, up with a quote? he's actually all natural, so he just can't, it's off the cuff. He, that's how he actually speaks, and his old man's a lot like that as well, so Apple fall, doesn't fall far from the tree. Give me the experience of your first game playing for Australia. Well, 55,000 Englishmen singing Sweet Low, Sweet Chariot, very nerve-wracking. <laughs> is, that, is that a favourite moment? Oh, that and also uh, winning on my birthday against the All Blacks. You're the relatively younger player in the team. What's it like to meet the senior players? Uh, to come into the camp for the first time is a bit overwhelming. You know, there's a lot of players there that you've, you've watched for many years. And so, you know, blokes like Adam Ashley Cooper that when I was growing up um, was, a, was a massive name in the game. So to come along and, and to play in teams alongside those guys is, is a dream come true. Blood is like Cup, being New Zealand, what has to happen? Well, they, they don't come around often, the wins against uh, New Zealand in the Bledisloe Cup. I think I've played them around 20-odd times now, and I've only won four or five, so you can only count them on one hand. So I think more than anything, it's, it's basically who, who wants it the most on the day. Uh, an absolute 80-minute performance, um, and you've got to beat your best because they are the best in the world at the moment.